shoebox Ice me up cause I'm too hot And I'm turning up like I'm Tupac I rock the kick before the shoe drop I ain't run from nothing, I hold cool pop It's a hell of a night and I'm bossed up And I'm feeling like I'm big goo wop I'm feeling like I'm big goo wop be, be, Feeling like I'm big goo wop It's a hell of a night and I'm bossed up And I'm feeling like I'm big goo wop I'm feeling like I'm big goo wop be, 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 Feeling like I'm big goo wop It's a hell of a night and I'm bossed up And I'm feeling like I'm big goo wop Yo, 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 skinny gang, what's good? We did it. 2K, y'all wanted it. Y'all been asking for it. The 2K sneaker collection, my sneaker collection at 2K. I'm giving it to y'all because y'all deserve it. Y'all been rocking with me since the beginning. So before we get into this, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that notification bell. Feel free to leave a comment down below. Let me know what sneakers you like, what you didn't like, and make sure you hit that like button. We're going to try to get this video here up to 40 likes. That's right. Make sure you share this here video because you're in the skinny gang. And if you're not in the skinny gang, once you hit that subscribe, you will be. So share this video and show your friends what your boy doing out here. So with that being said, let's get into my sneaker collection. This is my entire sneaker collection. And basically, I don't care how you feel about it because it's mine. But if you feel like it's trash, say in the comments it's trash. If you feel like it's all right, say in the comments it's all right. If you rock with it, you rock with it. But without further ado, I don't want to make this a long video. So let's go. Got some garbage right here for you. Uh, it's an Air Max. Don't know what kind it is, but I cut grass in it. So, hey, got to give it to y'all because y'all want the entire collection. And this here will probably be going to a homeless person soon. Got an Air Force One, classic Navy. Air Force One has 82 on here. Might have been something special, but I cut grass in this as well. And um, this here will be going to somebody homeless or somebody who just needs a pair of size 13. Got these a while back. My son really loved them. Uh, don't actually know the name of them. Uh, Nike Flight Systems, something like that. But um, I used to ball in them. Don't do nothing with them now. They didn't collect the dust, stuff like that. Just beat around with them. So these here will be uh, going to somebody who really needs them. Now, y'all probably already seen these. Rasheed Wallace's. Got them this year. Dope. I like Rasheed Wallace. That's why I got them. Air Force One High. Got to keep stomping in your Air Force One sometime. And you need Air Force One in your collection if you're a sneakerhead. So, Air Force One High. Rasheed Wallace. Love them. Another pickup this year, Air Max 97. My first Air Max 97, might as well have made it a classic. Got this here gold pair. Uh, shout out to Q the Queen for putting me up on these. Grab these here, straight up. Moving kind of fast, so bear with me. Penny Fives, Phoenix Suns. Dope shoe. Used to wear the hell out of it. Still looks new, actually. Uh, a little yellowing at the bottom coming in, but Phoenix Suns, Penny Hardaway 5. Man, this here is for sale. So if you wear a 13, throw me about 50 bucks on it. Let's go ahead and make this here happen. These here phone posit pennies, uh, rookies. All blue, the Memphis blue, uh, saluting his college. They was dope, still dope. Bottom yellow now, see the one cent on there. Carbon fiber, dope shoe. Cut a lot of hair in these shoes. See hair on the bottom. Throw me about 50, 60 bucks, you can get them. Up-tempo Olympic Pippins, not the ones that just released, but 
I forgot when I got these, maybe 2012, maybe? Uh, that Olympic year? Don't even know, but uh, definitely love this here shoe. It's not going nowhere. It'll be in the collection. Scottie Pippen Air Up Tempo Olympics with the eight on the back. Jason Kidd, California Barkley. Man, I got a lot of stories to tell. Not about this shoe, but about the original version when it first came out, man. Straight up. Um, dope shoe is yellowing on me because I didn't wear it a lot. I don't wear it a lot. I wore this shoe once. It's so beautiful, man, with the yellow. And now I got the Michigan um, 12. So it's just a reverse colorway, really, of this, except you got more maize on this one. But definitely, definitely a grail. I want to complete the pack, though. He has a Phoenix one, and he has a Dallas Maverick one, and he has a, um, another one, too. I want to say it's a Nick one. I'm not sure. Oh, a New Jersey Nets one. But um, I never did finish the pack. I was just so happy to get this one. And uh, it's an eye turner too, for some reason. Kind of heavy in the, today's times with all this here sole right here. It looks like a clunker, but man, my favorite non-Jordan ever, this shoe. My favorite Nike ever, this shoe right here. Jason Kidd, I think it was 95, Jason Kidd. Give you a little phone positive action. Safari foams, a lot of people slept on this here shoe. I'm not a foam positive fan, but I cop this shoe because I like it when the light hits it. All these here come out a little bit. This will probably be the only foam positive I keep, plus this Safari colorway. It's about the only Safari colorway I got. So I'll probably keep this one. Pull out the net, go on fishing foams. Gonna get rid of these here ASAP. So if you're interested in buying these, hit me up on IG and uh, we'll make this here happen. Only worn twice, as you can see. Got the bag and everything. So if you're a foam positive collector, come and get these. They need a good home. And uh, I'll be back. Okay, Skinny Gang, we're back. Got your KDs right here, your Easter KDs, fours. Again, cut hair in these. Probably be giving these here away to y'all, Skinny Gang, in a giveaway. So stay tuned for that. Got them right here. Kevin Durant, fours. Kevin Durant fives, I'm sorry. Some more KD fives, DMVs. Uh, the DMV area where he was from, he put these here out. Be giving these here away also, Skinny Gang. So be on the lookout for these. Uh, this is a rare, pre a rare pair actually, but be on the lookout for these. Don't want these here anymore, so. It is what it is. Might as well hook y'all up. While we on KDs, we got here this KD7. Good apples, I think. Dope shoe. Make me an offer, you can get these. Really cop these, because I remember this here was around when that Yeezy colorway was going off and he was leaving Nike. So they were throwing the colorway on different shoes and I missed the Yeezy foams. So I picked these here up. Uh, dope shoe though, actually, but it can go. If anybody wants it, hit me up. KD6, N7. Uh, when the lights hit, when the light hits these, all this here shows up. But um, all right, shoe. These shoes here are not comfortable. I hate them, but um, if you want them, make me an offer. You can get them. KD sevens. If you're a KD fan, KD sevens, KD six, and seven. Grab these. Nike 
Another six, peanut butter and jelly. KD's, this is a dope shoe. I love this shoe here. This here will stay in the collection. Dope concept. KD, you did this here. Peanut butter and jelly. Not considered a sneaker, but um, it was an exclusive release to DTLR. Timbaland, everybody should have some Tims. Um, only wore these one time, they fit kind of big, so it's exclusive. Still got the tag and all that on them. Uh, Baby Blue North Carolina Tims. When I did rock them, got a lot of compliments on them actually, so um, they already crept. If you want these, get at me. little special box the man the legend itself Kyrie Kyrie ones like this shoe is mad comfortable uh, the Kyrie ones I always keep this uh, his first signature shoe like back here them hints right there Kyrie one skinny gang One of my favorite players to ever play the game. Got these Kobe Bryant sevens. This is one of my favorite shoes, animal print. See the leopard on the back. This definitely was one of my favorite shoes. My favorite Kobe, it is my favorite Kobe. Another Kobe, Kobe 8, special Christmas edition. You see the ornament right there. Nothing real special about this shoe. I think, I think it comes with a second pair of laces. Still got the second pair of laces in here. Dope shoe, and I got it. I like this stuff right here, but um, got barbecue sauce on it. Been grilling in it, but hey. Kobe is safe in my collection, because like I said, one of my favorite players to ever play. Second favorite Laker behind Magic Johnson. So, um, it is what it is. Kobe, you safe in my collection, buddy. Got another Kobe 8 system. This here was the Easter release. Um, I thought this here was the dopest release that year. As you can see how, like, the dye, the egg dye, goes from green to yellow to purple. Uh, I thought this here was a dope shoe. The Kobe autograph right here. Mad light, mad comfortable. This was before Boost, and um, I love this shoe. Now, King James, the Laker of the future. See what we got right here. These here are the nine lows. The nine and the eight, I think, was his dopest colorway. The nine highs and the eight highs. But this here was dope. Um, I work in Orangeburg, and their high school has these colors, so used to like to rock this here. Shout out to the OW Bruins. Dope shoe. Thought about getting it custom and getting their mascot put here, but never did. Got another one. I struck out on the South Beaches, so I thought this here was the next best thing. It was a low, and um, this here is a dope shoe. The shoe strings, everything about this here shoe is dope. You know what I'm saying? It's not a South Beach, but it's still dope to me. I got this LeBron 11. Not going in no particular order, Skinny Gang. Just trying to get it to y'all. This was the Christmas 11. I bought this and the Kobe's at the same time. As you can see, actually thought I sold this shoe, but I sold the 10, the Christmas 10, not this one. But you still see the ornaments on it. This is actually a nice shoe. I haven't worn it in a while. Like I said, I thought I sold it, but it's still in the collection. So receipt and all still up in here. Hey, here's what it is. I'll put it back in rotation. 
A shooter that I don't know why in the hell I bought, but I bought it, it was spontaneous. I just needed some shoes to go around and beat, and I bought these. What a dummy I was to buy these, but they was on sale, and I got hit with the impulse purchase. But the LeBron soldiers, um, straight jacket shoes, I call them. But they actually was made, I like the concept because they was actually made for like kids who have um, defects and can't tie their own shoes. So um, they made the straps, but I don't like this shoe, man. Hey, one of y'all out here, come get this shoe if you wear a size 13. Hit me up. Man, come get this shoe here, man, for 50 bucks, something like that. Another shoe I'll be selling, getting out of my collection ASAP, the 12. The 12, the Akron branch or whatever they call it, with Akron all around it in the wintertime, instead of being a Christmas shoe. That's what they called it. I copped it. Uh, I always love how LeBron used to do little details with the shoestrings, but haven't copped a LeBron since, and um, I will. If he signs with the Lakers, I will. Stay tuned for that video. But let me go grab some more shoes, and I'll be right back. All right, Skinny Gang, back with the Adidas portion of the vid. We just seen all my Nikes, so now we're going to get into these here Adidas. So let's go. These here hibachis, the Gilbert Arenas. These here are so old, man. Got Gilbert Arenas' autograph right here, man. The original Steph Curry. He could heat you up when he was hot, he was hot. But, um, man, these here was dope. I used to ball in these. Uh, the Gilbert Arenas Adidas. Washington Wizards. Got these here. These here Adidas Tubulars. I refer to them as fake Yeezys. I copped these at the time where, you know, Yeezys was real hard to get, but they're not hard to get anymore, so. Still a nice looking shoe, nice casual shoe. I tend to wear them when I'm out doing real estate, stuff like that, so uh, definitely, definitely nice shoe. But, like I call them, fake Yeezys, but if you like them, I love them, I bought them, I rocked them. If y'all want them, hey, Y'all know the magic number, 50 bucks. I'm shipping them out to you. Now let's get to this here Adidas heat, or as some would say, hype be stuff. Got these moon clouds right here. Salute the Columbia kicks. Got these. Know y'all seen them. NMD Trails, Pharrell Williams. Got these here 500s for you. Pull them out. Yellow Moon, wear these here a lot, bruh. Super comfortable. They're not boosts, but super comfortable. Retro Wiz Kid asked me was they comfortable. Yes, sir, they are. I'm going to do an on foot on these. I um, think Sniper Jones did an on foot on these, so you can go check his out. I haven't actually seen the video, but I've seen it come up on my timeline. I do want to check it out, but definitely comfortable. Comfortable shoe. Dad shoe. I am a dad, and it's a dope at work shoe. You can wear it with casual stuff or whatever, walk around. So instead of catchers, Instead of sketches, rock the 500s. Got you another human race right here. The walk and breathe joint. As you can see. I had the, uh, the cream, the holy pack, but I traded it in. Got this 350 boost right here. My son done spilt uh, some kind of icy stuff on the box. Core Black, uh, I've been wearing this here shoe. The most limited Yeezy out now. Once they uh, restock those frozen yellows, this will be the most limited Yeezy out, so. 
I was lucky to get these here for retail. Shout out to Hibbit Sports, Orangeburg, South Carolina. Uh, I think that was like a Black Friday release or something like that, but they released three uh, different shoes, different colors the same day, and I was able to hit with that one on the raffle, and I think my brother hit with the green one, or either the tan, I don't know. But, another 350, actually my favorite 350 that came out last year, and uh, there it is, the blue tints. Uh, we'll be going hard. These are still DS, actually. We'll be going hard for those, um, the butters that's dropping. If I hit the butters, I'm probably going to sell my yellow moon, so be on the lookout for that. Uh, I believe, Skinny Gang, time for the Jordans. All right, Skinny Gang, let's start off with these here Jordan 1s. Getting hot out here, man. But, yo, nothing's too good for y'all, bruh. Salute. I don't even, I done gave y'all reviews on them. Clay Greens. I have worn these one time. Material's garbage, too. Toe box is gonna crease. Can't stop that, but wear your damn shoes. Clay Greens. This is seat in here. Oh, y'all already know what these are. Homage to Holmes. Like I said, a little plushness on mine, but compared to the other ones I've seen, they was plush. Haven't worn these here yet, because I haven't found the right outfit to wear it with. Don't want to look like one of these here country bumpkins with a split jersey down the middle. So, haven't found out what to wear with this here yet, but when I do, I will put them things on the ground. i have already seen these. Do I have to take them out the box? The cup of the year, off-white ones. I've worn these a couple of times. As you can see, I put the orange laces in mine, but definitely, definitely my cop of the year. Able to put some off-white in my collection for retail. Definitely a win. Another cop from this year, the year of the ones, the blue moon, still DS. Thought about making these into some custom um, frags. Can't find nobody to do the stamp, but um, it would be dope maybe if I get those Hyper Royal ones, put a frag mark in it or something like that. But hey, still DS, dope. Gonna pull it out one day soon. This right here, the bread toe, just was able to put this here in my collection. I traded those uh, red suede Toro 18s for this shoe. Shout out to Columbia Kicks and man, yo, this shoe, I was hollering at my partner, Dunn Kicks, and he was like, man, you got to get your bread toe in your collection. This the shoe that started it all. For all of y'all, man, who just, uh, who haven't been following the Skinny Gang, following the channel. Uh, I got this here shoe. Um, Unbreakable Kicks made a call to action. Said he was short on um, securing a pair of the pre-orders. Did anybody have uh, any bread toes that, that he could get for a reasonable price? And I was like, bruh, I got a pair for you, man. You know what I'm saying? Just give me retail what I paid for them. And the rest is history. We've been linked up, kicking it ever since. You know what I'm saying? So uh, definitely, definitely. This shoe here holds a lot of meaning to this channel and uh, it will never get traded. Thanks to Columbia Kicks for getting me this here pair and I can't wait to put these things here on the ground. Probably a rock them at Sneaker Con too. Some more stuff. Another pair I can't wait to the winter to undeice. These here shadows, still DS. Shadow ones, nothing special. Want a pair? Get them on StockX. Think they still below retail.
Black toes, dope shoe, man. Dope, dope shoe. I'm glad I got the bread toes now because now I can quit uh, wearing these so much. Need to go here. Got a little dirt right here. Need to get a little rejuvenator, whatever crap going on over these here. Huh. Remember these right here, still DS. I need to break these here out. I got an outfit for these and everything. Gold toes. Uh, somebody called my phone, sorry about that, but gold toes. Uh, I need to put these on the ground. They're still DS. I was um, actually trying to see if I could get a good deal on some top three gold toes, and then I was gonna go ahead and sell these, but it hasn't come across yet, but still, this here is a dope shoe, and um, it's still DS, still in my collection. Don't think it's leaving. This right here is my first um, Jordan 1. My partner Dunn's Kicks hit me with this here shoe. It is plush. Been loving Jordan 1's ever since. Grail status. And these right here, top threes. See a little bit of that glitter effect coming in, but so what? Dope shoe. Definitely have worn it a couple of times. And, uh, hey man, it is what it is. That's all of my Jordan 1s. And since I only own one pair of Jordan 2s, I said, let me go ahead and get this here out the way for y'all. Y'all already know what it is. The Carmelo Anthony 2. I think this here is dope. People going crazy over the Camelo 13. I'm not. If I cop it, I cop it. Right now, I'm like, nah, because... I don't like Carmelo like that. I do like the Chris Paul um, 12s. Love Chris Paul's game, man. So um, it's a no-brainer about that. I will be putting those Chris Paul 12s in my collection. So um, with that being said, let me go grab some threes and fours. Let's get it. Fours, laser fours. Uh, what are these here once, man? Uh, look like they're trying to start yelling a little bit thinking about making them a custom But I think I'm just gonna go ahead and sell these so Skinny gang hit me up if you want them if not I'll probably just trade them for some more heat I'll Go ahead and take it on down to Columbia kick sell them Got an Air Jordan 3 right here True blue threes Nike Air on the back Everybody complains about the material is ass, but I still think it was a dope shoe. I paid retail for the shoe, and um, I wish I had got me another pair. Still in great condition. Just need to uh, clean it up a little bit, but definitely, definitely dope. Dope OG3. OG4, Cement 4, Jumpman on the back, no Nike Air on the back. Uh, I do plan on getting me one with Nike Air on the back, only because this one here is kind of getting old. There's no yellow in here yet, but I could tell with some crease marks, but man, this here is in good shape, man, to say that when I got it. Pinnacle 4, snakeskin, dope shoe. Dust bag, everything's in here. Might sell it eventually for some more heat. 
Man, I'm tired of looking at shoes. The Katrina 3. Still DS. Need to put some miles on it, cause it's already about to be July, and before you know it, the summer will be up, and we'll be back rocking dark sneakers. But I just wait till next year. Take a hat feels. A must that I wanted this year when I heard about it. Here they're about to bring out some beige ones that got higher instead of Nike right here. They can keep that trash. I like these. The only other one of these that I think that I would get are the Justin Timberlakes, but take a hat feel salute for this shoe. Definitely was a dope pickup. Some say this here is the release of the year so far. Black Cement 3s, Nike Air on the back. Didn't double up, probably should have, but if I need another pair, they're not going that much above um, retail. Bread 4s. Jumpman on the back. They released next year with the Nike Air. I'm all over it. Still real good shape right here. Got a little pollen on here, but um, that came from wearing them. Down south, the pollen drops hard. So um, need to clean these here up a little bit before I rock them next time. But hey, is what it is, man. Be back with some fives and sixes. <laughs> Y'all working me, skinny gang. Hot as hell. Skinny gang. My favorite five. See it? My favorite five right here. Raging Bull five. They need to retro that shoe. My second favorite five. Bring this back, Jordan brand, and put Nike Air on the back, please. Man, bro, I don't even wear this shoe enough, bro. I need to start wearing it, man. Starting to yellow down here. Not yellowing up here, but, oh, man. I need to bring these here out for the summer, man. Straight up, man. Got a lot of stuff, man, just sitting. Like I said, I'm in the process of moving, so have these things here packed up. So I don't really get to see what's in them. That's definitely, I love that shoe. That will be on foot soon. Grail status. Starting to yellow a little bit, but definitely, man. Definitely, bro. The first shoe I bought, you know what I mean, with my own money. The first Air Jordan that I bought. Not this one. Last time I said that was like, how you just bought? This your first time buying shoes? Nah, like back in 95, I believe, maybe, maybe 90, when did I, 93, I think, 92, 92, 93? Y'all correct me in the comments, but I think it was like 92, maybe? Bought this shoe, man. Seat right here. Man, brings back memories, bro. Black Metallics Nike Air on the back. Classic shoe. Nothing much to say about it. If you don't have it in your collection, you sleep. Oh, man. These things here are still DS, bro. I need to put some smoke to these are DS, man. These have been DS for years. Nike Air on the back, Maroon 6. I'm always talking about wear your damn shoes. I guess I need to wear some of these here shoes, bro. I will, as soon as I get to a spot. Lab box. Five Lab 3, the three Lab 5s, whatever you wanna call them. Thought this here was dope. This here was the first one made, the elephant print. Got some more, but I traded them off. I think I traded them to Columbia Kicks, the um, infrared, the black and infrared pair, but this is definitely a dope pair. 
I always get compliments when I rock this. Still even got the card in it. Oh man, y'all already know what this is. Man, I had a time getting this here shoe. When I got this shoe, I was just starting YouTube, StockX, which I guess the StockX tag don't really mean nothing no more. Gatorade towel. This shoe here, man. I already uh, lace swapped it, put in the white laces, but I wore it one time, man. And man, it was a hell of a night when I wore these, but uh, definitely, man. Definitely, it was a must have at that time. And now, I always tease Dunn Kicks like, man, I need to sell this issue, but it is what it is. And this right here, man, I haven't even rocked these in a minute though, but Olympic Sixes, they are yellowed out. I probably need to do a restoration on these, but I kind of like the yellowing. It shows, you know, the wear in them, but I might get these here deoxidized as well as my fire engine, um, I mean my raging bulls, but Olympic Six, I wonder when they're gonna retro these here again. Need a new pair. One of my favorite sixes, by the way, but the Carmine Six is my favorite six. So, no sevens in my collection, no eights in my collection. I will be back with the nine and the tens, and um, maybe the nines and the tens, and the 12, and the 13s and save the 11s for last. Also, I got a couple of um, non-hyped uh, Jordans, some old garbage, you know what I mean? Some of that old garbage that uh, Journeyman Bostic likes to keep around his house. I'll throw that in the collection as well. I'll be right back. I'm about sick of y'all now. Let's get into it, man. No particular order, bro. French blues. Need to put these here on feet, man. I'm missing all my summertime heat, bro. French blue 12s, ladies and gentlemen. I remember I got those early. I had to pay like 50 or 60 bucks extra. Got those early. Along with these as well, blue games. See them? Blue game 12s. My personal favorite 12 taxis. My taxis still look good, but I still need them to release this here pair again so I can get me another pair. Love the taxis, man. Everybody and their mama done showed you these, as well as me. But uh, Michigan 12s. Don't know if I'll keep them in the collection yet, but hey, I might. If not, y'all got first dibs on them. Let's get this here trash out the way. Last shot. Grail, but still, man. I don't like how Jordan Brand gave it to us. But all in all, need this here in your collection. Bread 13, another sitter. Set for a long time, but um, it's a grail, man. Come on, man. You sleep if you don't have the bread 13 in your collection. Man. Another sitter. Still sitting as we speak, but I got this here for the low, like, I forgot, but 134 or something, 143, out the door, 134, but 
dope, bro. Can't wait to the winner to put some miles on these right here. It'll save those shadow ones. But OG, OG box, everything. Y'all already know that hype train is gone. Let's see what else I got back here. It's 23 paper. What's this? Oh. He got games. The only nine that I own. Still DS. Uh man, still DS, bro. I need to put some dirt on these. Best point guard that's been doing it for a while, CP3, Chris Paul, 13s. Need to put this here white. I need to get the white pair and put in the collection, but this is still dope. And the legendary Ferrari 14. Only other 14 that I own. Can't wait for the uh, candy canes to drop. And uh, I should be good with the 14s. I'll probably try to put the black toe in the collection. As far as the nines, I'm good. Give me a cool gray nine and I'm straight. Uh, I had the cool gray nine, but I sold it back in the day. And uh, basically that's it. Uh, I do want to get me a seven and an eight. Uh, the eight, I want to go ahead and get the Aqua eight, which I will get. It's nothing hard to get. Uh, the seven, haven't decided it'll probably be a Raptor seven or, or a Brodeau seven. Maybe that N7, I like the N7 too. Um, that N77 seven, seven silhouette. But uh, man, enough of that, man. It's hot, I got stuff I need to do. So uh, let me get you with these here 11s and these other garbage Jordans so I can get up out of here. All right, skinny gang, reaching the end. These here non-retros, some flip sides. Don't want these. You know what? You know what would be a good idea? I might just go ahead and just ship these things here to Journeyman Bostic. He likes trash like this in his collection, so. Might clean these up and send them out. I just cut grass in this here trash, though. But this here was a skater shoe. Was trying to be like, it's a flip side, a seven and a three. You see the seven tongue, the three silhouette, skateboarding shoe. Y'all probably know what time it is. Best of both worlds, garbage, shadow 10, Air Force bottom, flea market specials, they used to call them. But, um, hey, I forgot even where I got, oh, I got this one here from Foot Action Warehouse. But, um, yeah, stuff like this needs a good home. This one here is pretty in pretty good condition. Matter of fact, I haven't cut no grass in it. Got the boot laces in it. Uh, Journeyman Bostic, coming to you, Jack. Now, let's knock this here video rest of the way out. Pantone 11s, gotta love them. Shout out to nine out of 10 condition. Roberto, you looked out. Size 14. Not my size, got these. These are up for sale if you want them. If not, I'm gonna trade them out because I don't want none of this here garbage in my collection. Don't want no 11 lows in my collection. Gold medals, 11 lows. You can see, size 14, receipt and everything. If y'all want them, hit me up. I don't want this trash. Some more garbage, Georgetown 11 lows. I like the Georgetown colorway. These here have yellowed. I cook out in these shoes now. Keep them for stuff like cookout purposes, just stuff around the house. I like the Georgetown 11 lows, but uh, it's definitely gonna become a beater shoe, a work shoe. Not even fit to sell. Or I would sell it. Would I might even try to do a rejuvenator uh, restoration on these or something like that. If Tony D ever sends me some rejuvenator, but I probably just order some, man. Salute to Tony D. Now 
Now, Jumpman box. Uh, if y'all already know, Jordans don't come in this type of box anymore. Mids, but these did. One of my favorite Jordans. Any day of the week you ask me, it'll either be the Carmine 6 or these right here, the Bread 11s. Uh, only because of the history that I have with this here shoe. It's amazing. I'm going to tell the story about this shoe one day. Hopefully next year we'll be getting this one. If not, we'll be getting the cool grays. Hopefully it's one of them. Or they might just hit us with a new colorway. Or they might give us two 11s like they've been doing lately. So keep my fingers crossed, man. Never could have too many pairs of these. Gamma, 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 gamma. Gamma, 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 gamma. Had a lot of people comparing uh, this here gamma earlier this year. Gamma. I don't rock it a lot. Need to give it some more wear, but man. Dope shoe. Also, one of my favorite 11s. Uh, not that popular, but I like it. I always did. And this joint needs a good cleaning, bro. Definitely. Uh, I see my partner's got a pair down there. I might just go ahead and pick me up a spare pair because it's nothing, though. That little elbow grease can't get out. It's not that bad, but this here is one of my favorites, man. Another size 14. The only two size 14s I have in my collection. 72 and 10. Um, probably do a size swap for these. Don't get rid of none of my mids, so I'll probably do a size swap on these or just keep them. But um, they didn't have my size, so I had to go one up. So I grabbed these. These look like boats. Don't wear them. I wore them once, uh, I think, the day that I got them, that Christmas, but nice material, man. If I get me a size swap on them, definitely i jump on that. Release from last year, still DS. Do I have to show this? Guess I gotta show this, man. We done came too far, man, to get lazy. This thing is wrapped up, man. Spare me, spare me, spare me. Like I said, DS, bro. This joint is clean. I haven't rocked them yet, like I said, but look forward to. Still got everything in it. Like I said, spare me, spare me, Jordan Brand. Spare me today. Comment down below if anybody who has these has worn theirs already. I didn't want to wear mine on purpose because y'all know how that Christmas Jordan is. Uh, it's hype, so every time you go out, you see somebody wearing it. So I usually try to keep mine on ice until the next year. Shout out to OG Sneakers. I heard him say that too. That's his little ritual. Four or five. Go into space, space jams, four or five. Y'all already know what time it is, man. If y'all still here at the end of this here video, I have a treat for y'all. Cause I'm tired, but Told y'all I was gonna get it out to y'all. 
and I bust my butt today to get it out to y'all. So, I'm always a man of my word. The only 11 low that I respect. And it's crazy because it also has respect on it. The Jeter 11 low. Dope shoe, comes with inserts and all. Jordan brand, you really did good by this here shoe. Now, I don't know anybody who's gonna be able to grab those highs unless they finally do a release on them because I don't think there's that many pair in existence and they are high. Coming to the end, win like 82s, still DS. I don't even think I opened this here box in the game to tell the truth, man. I know, I know, I know. But I'm not planning on wearing them until this year, maybe. All oh, this here wrapping, Jordan Brand. There you have it. I think this here is a dope shoe, though. I mean, I can put some uh, miles on it when that Concord drop. Thought this here was a dope colorway. Like I said, haven't even left the box yet. Still DS. Comment down below um, some of the shoes that y'all need to DS, man. I need to DS quite a few, as you can see. But they will get DS. One thing about shoes, kind of like cars, once you put your foot in them, they lose their value a little bit. But um, hey. Cap and gown action. Did a review on these. I know y'all already seen it already. Uh, I had a chance to talk to my homeboy Andre today, who does inspections for me. He said he likes, he doesn't like the tassel laces. He likes the boot laces better, but I was trying to tell him the tassel laces kind of gives it's a cap and gown so it gives the shoe its own little we both agreed it was better than the gamblers but there you have it hot out here And as y'all already know, that special 2K unboxing I did for y'all. This DS DMP pack, man. Again, I can't thank Columbia Kicks enough. Uh, they believed in the channel. They believed in me. And uh, we're growing together, man. Matter of fact, they're about to get a new location. Can't wait to vlog their new location. Shout out to Josh and Adam. Thanks for the pack. I just showed y'all this pack, but for the vid, I gotta open it again. And show y'all this six. I just love this right here. Let's show y'all the six. And the DMP 11. Skinny gang. There you have it. Now, if you rock with me to the end of this here video, salute to you, man. Now, it's time to give you this here giveaway. I need you to comment down below how many pairs of shoes that I own in my collection. And then I need you to follow me on IG. Hit me in the DM. 
with Skinny Gang and the number as well. And I'm gonna put a picture up on IG about my sneaker collection. Comment under that uh, picture. Done, D-O-N-E. And um, hey, we'll pick a random winner. And the random winner, man, it's not even just gonna be for you. It's gonna be for you and somebody else. You know what I'm saying? The random winner will get a pair of KDs out of my collection. Uh, you can do whatever you want with them. You can sell them. You can rock them if you don't wear 13. But I've got two pairs. So the winner is going to get their own personal pair. And then the next pair, I'm actually watching a deer, bro. I know you don't believe me. But look, can y'all see? Deer running through my neighborhood, bro. I don't know if y'all see him trotting, but um. Anyway, y'all will get a pair, and then y'all will get a chance to roll with me on the vlog and see me bless somebody who I think really needs a pair of shoes. And um, y'all will roll with me. They're gonna get them free of charge. It's theirs, so um, that'll be like from Skinny Gang to them and I want to be give y'all something from me to y'all from rolling with me so with that being said man I'm tired about to go get me a cold drink hope y'all enjoyed this video thanks for rolling with me man the next sneaker collection that we will have will be at 10k so man I'm not going through this again until 10k but I look forward to be rolling with y'all until then man until then Love y'all, like always. Thanks for coming with me. And you spent a whole bunch of time on this here video. That's time you can't get back. So thank you. Salute to you. I love y'all. And so Sneaker Collection. Hope y'all enjoyed it.